10 games of hoops on a Saturday night. Let's take flight on the one and only top 10 on NBA.com. At number 10, Bradley Beal gets us started making history as the king of the DC3. This triple right here allowed him to pass Gilbert Arenas. Yeah, Gilbert Arenas. What a name. That good for number 10. On to number 9, where it's a brand new bold purple and gold. Lance on the dish, Kyle Kuzma, gets the reverse finish at number 9. Stay in L.A. for number 8, where JaVale is falling out of bounds, but he finds the king who's throwing down. LeBron, in his home debut, goes busting through for these two that good for number 8. Same game, different team at number 7. The MVP dust the king on his way to throwing down this thing. Look out, JaVale, you might want to bail because James Harden bringing the truth from the roof at number 7. At number 6, Damian Lillard shaking up Patty Mills like a fresh can of orange juice before letting loose on a smooth little J to get the number 6 play for the Portland Trailblazers. On to number five, and for the first time this year, it's Terrence Ross, like a boss, like a half-court boss, in fact, to beat the shot clock buzzer like he meant it. That's good for number five. To Philly for number four, where J.J. makes the tray that decides the day. Reddit takes the handoff from Embiid before letting fly from behind the line. The Sixers get the win. He gets in at number four. At number three, we go to Dallas, where Dennis is trying to end this. On Derrick Rose, he creates some space before landing the J. All up in his face, a little and one fun. At number three for Dennis Smith Jr. On to number two to see what Kelly Oubre can do for you. John Wall can't get it to go, but Oubre... Gets the rebound, hammer throw, a little stair action as well. That's good for number two, but at number one, strap on your seat belts because we're about to take flight on a Derrick Jones Jr. southpaw spike. Rising up like the Miami Sun, Derrick Jones Jr. lands at number one on NBA.com. Put it!